So welcome back to another vlog. Uh, we're sitting in the uh, parking lot to IKEA at the moment because we're gonna go in and buy some stuff, and then have the apartment tour. Yeah, we're gonna pick up some uh, stuff for the apartment, and yeah, later we'll uh, give you an apartment tour and go through some details in how we found the apartment and a little bit about how it works here in Spain or here in Mallorca. Um, with the rental apartments and yeah so uh, yeah let's go inside Drinking glasses now <laughs> because we don't really like ours because they're really really big. But it's a really small IKEA compared to in Sweden, so it's kind of unusual to be honest. The bathroom department. I need, uh, or I would like to have some uh, containers or jars for the cotton pads, you know? Yeah. Uh, so I'm looking for something like that. That we want, wanted to eat because we're both very hungry again, and it's almost two in the afternoon. It's two, yeah, ten to two, and uh, yeah, we need some uh, energy to continue this. Yeah, it's a lot of people here today. It's a lot of people. Honest. It's uh, not the best day we've chosen. Oh. Saturday. Did we find, find our map? I think so. Discover this one. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is another one. So, have we decided on the small beige map? Yeah, didn't have uh, the size that we originally wanted in the, in the map. So we have to go for either like a super big or a small. Like super big map. We need somewhere to write our schedules and uh, weekly plans. Yeah, shopping lists and uh, yeah, stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Let's do it. Can be stores and I thought I'd show you what we got and do a little haul and um, I have a little coffee and uh, I know it's really late it's like uh, 6 30 but it's uh, decaf so it's fine <laughs> so um, as you know we went to IKEA on a Saturday which was a really bad idea it was so much people and therefore we couldn't film as much as we wanted um, but um, yeah anyway I think you've been to Ikea once so you know how it is 
But we got some um, jars, bowls to bake and cook in. Um, the apartment that we have rented is fully furniture and have everything. It's just that we wanted to like add some things that is by our touch and you know make it your home kind of. Um, and also some stuff that we use every day that we didn't have here. Uh, for example, some more hangers. <laughs> Even though we got rid of a lot of clothes, we still uh, apparently have some left. <laughs> so we got some basic hangers. We got two champagne glasses. And just a jar. I thought I'm gonna make some uh, granola soon, so have some granola. And two light bulbs or candlelights. I think it's called in English. Um, and they only had like tea mugs here, so I bought some small coffee mugs. Bath mat. And some organized boxes, interior for our wardrobe. Um, this, which I think this only exists in Sweden, therefore you can only buy it in IKEA. But these are like the best things ever. <laughs> um, some plastic jars or containers, um, some glasses, candles. Um, what do you call this? A sheet, sheet, <laughs> a sheet, and some like cutlery or tools for to cook with. Um, another jar, just some pillowcases. Oh, and and we got. It's a whiteboard and some pens. So uh, yeah, we're gonna kind of make a weekly schedule or you can make lists or you know, when you run out of something and you can write it here. Otherwise, I at least always forget. And then when I'm going to the supermarket or the store, I always forget it anyway. And then I come home and I'm oh my God, I'm, I missed that thing. <laughs> um, cutting board. Um, yeah, so that was everything from IKEA. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We also got this right from IKEA. Because uh, there's no rug in this uh, living room, and we thought now, uh, like when it's winter time, it gets quite cold here in Mallorca. Like, the apartments are not. Um, the best win like for winter, so it can get really cold. So we thought it would be nice to have something on the floor. Um, but anyway, after IKEA, we went to Primark. I love Prim Primark. We don't have it in Sweden. Um, and I got we got some like small throws or blankets. This, there is none here, so just like cozy blankets. Did I just break it? And some things for the bathroom to keep like some cotton pads in and just for soap and like toothbrushes. Yeah, that was everything. 
from Primark. And then, yeah, Matthias got two t-shirts. It's not like home decor or anything, but I thought they were really nice. Just like basic. It was a really cool store actually. Um, Chaotic, it was called. It's from Barcelona. It's like a skate boutique. Super nice. So he got two t-shirts as well. Yeah, that's uh, everything from this haul. Welcome back. <laughs> we um, went to Ikea yesterday and uh, today is Sunday. We are on a walk right now around our neighborhood up to a castle actually. That's just located here in a park, um, kind of above where we live. And uh, it's quite famous to come and visit in Palma. So yeah, we're gonna go there now. It's a sunny, beautiful day and the path up is really beautiful as well. We'll see you up there. So we took the bus. Yeah. <laughs> and now it's uh, quarter past twelve. And uh, here in Spain they don't really eat lunch at oh. this hour. So uh, it's breakfast again. So for us it's also for breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, we're in Santa Catalina. And, uh, it's just five minutes away from us. Yeah. With the bus. our apartment we thought we'd show you how we live here and yeah this is the entrance so here's the hallway and yeah not so much to say about that it's a hallway and if we turn around we have our bedroom and yeah like our lamp doesn't really want to listen to us sometimes and sometimes the controller works yeah it's this one okay never mind <laughs> um, this is the bedroom we have a lot of storage in here which is great because the apartment isn't that big uh, you can actually lift up the bed and uh, there's like full storage underneath and then we have a wall of um, wardrobes we have one here and we have some outdoor clothes. Matthias has one here and I have mine here. Yeah. So yeah, a lot of storage. And yeah, this is where we sleep. Mm -hmm. So if we continue, we have our little bathroom here. Really cute. And we are really happy that we have a washing machine and a dryer. It's a two-in-one actually. Uh, we're still trying to figure it out because <laughs> uh, the machine keeps uh, putting it on five-hour programs. Yeah, and we don't really know how it dries because it's basically always wet when it comes out. <laughs> yeah, so that's a problem. But yeah, figuring it out. 
So yeah, this is the bathroom. And then we have a living room and kitchen. Very airy and bright. I love that it's like big windows and we have a lot of light all day so it doesn't feel small and dark. Um, but yeah, we have a dishwasher, which is like, we weren't expecting that in a small apartment like this. Um, the fridge, it's a mini, mini fridge. And yeah, everything you need in a kitchen. <laughs> and then uh, the living room. Uh, everything is very modern. Uh, all lamps and everything have controls to like turn on and off. Yeah. The TV is like smart TV. And then we have AC, which you can turn like on to heat and uh, to cold, obviously. We haven't needed to use uh, needed to use it yet, but it's probably gonna be really useful in the winter later on. Yeah, and obviously in the summer. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, this is the where we spend most time, and this is one of the best parts: our balcony. And again, I really like that you can like slide the doors to one side, so it gets like one with the living room, which makes it bigger. So when we eat here, we normally put the doors to this side. Yeah, they're kind of heavy. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like... We are here, and then we have this for you. Yeah, I think we're on the third floor. I think it's six floors in total, yeah. but I think it's perfect. Uh, I wouldn't want to be lower because then you would only see the wall of the next house. Now at least we have like space. Yeah, this is actually a uh, hotel, so it's always kind of close. But otherwise we almost have sea view. <laughs> you can actually see some of the ma masts on the boats. And uh, where we went on the hike today was up there, like you can see the forest, the, um, the park, trees. the park uh, where we walked. Um, yeah. So this is our little inn. Yeah. And so far, I mean, we've only been here one week, but so far we're really happy. And I know the area. I've lived uh, actually on this street, just a couple of like houses up. Um, so I know the area really well, and yeah, it feels like I'm back home again. <laughs> yeah, feels so, yeah. really good. Yeah. So now you've seen the apartment and what we've done today with all the hiking and the castles and everything. Yeah, and uh, yeah, how we found this apartment was really coincidence coincidental, because. Um, I was looking in a lot of uh, Facebook groups like uh, homes in Mallorca, apartments in Mallorca or rentals. Oh, there's like a ton of uh, Facebook groups for just apartments and rentals specifically. Uh, so I've been commenting on some people's posts and then I got a message from a woman uh, and she said that she'd seen my comments and that she had an apartment and was asking if I was interested. And yeah, yeah she uh, sent me pictures and then I asked one of my friends uh, here in Mallorca to go and view it. And uh, she went for on the viewing, sent me, or us, she sent us a film yeah. of everything. And in the film it actually looked a lot smaller than it actually is. Yeah. So we were really surprised when we came here. Yeah, yeah, it was, uh, it feels much more spacious. So maybe that won't show on the video, but it's, uh, I don't, I'm not sure about the square meters. What can no. it be? Maybe 50, 55 yeah. square meters. It really works. Like it's enough space for two people. Easily. Oh yeah, yeah, uh, absolutely. The only thing we would want more is one more room for our office for me. Yeah. Because uh, with my work and everything with distance. But anyway, so uh, then um, after my friend went to that she had been here and saw it, met the people who owns the apartment, it felt a lot safer for us to uh, to decide 
uh, because here in Spain you pay um, a deposit for an apartment and that can be up to three months rents uh, for deposits but usually it's around one or two uh, months rents and yeah and si since she contacted me uh, she doesn't have this apartment up on any agencies or uh, through a company uh, or anything so it's like purely private um, so that's very good because yeah. normally if you go through an agency which we also looked into I was looking with some agencies I had contact with uh, um, a few people that was working for agencies and they were giving me like or us uh, options for apartments yeah when I say me, it's because mainly I did all the looking. She did the looking and she found the apartment and she fixed everything. To be honest. <laughs> it was just because I have uh, a lot more contacts yeah. since I've lived here before. I know all the areas and uh, yeah, knows. it was just easier for me to kind of handle it because I've yeah. done it once before and yeah, I just have a little bit more information about the, the island in yeah. general. Um, so yeah, and. Uh, like we talked about the area, uh, I've lived here before and uh, it's a really nice area yeah. and uh, for now it's really good and then we'll see in the future. Uh, we have some we... goals in mind that yeah. we, we want to move closer to that part of Palma, it's basically outside Palma. Just mainly because we want to be closer to the beach yeah. Um, and uh, yeah but now in winter it doesn't really matter. And, mm. As long as I'm in school, the school is uh, like on the other side of Palma from here, so it takes me 20 minutes on the bus uh, from we are, where we are now. Mm. So we, would we move even further outside, it would take me almost an hour, I think, to go yeah. back and forth. And yeah, so for now it's super to be here. And yeah, um, yeah we're really happy. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's it for this vlog. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much for watching and mm -hmm. like and subscribe. Yeah, and please comment if you have any questions or if you have any ideas for what you would want to see. Yeah. We have some more ideas for uh, videos that we want to film for you guys. And um, yeah, well, we would love some um, tips if you yeah. have any. Yeah. And if you're wondering anything mm -hmm. about Spanish or like about Mallorca, Spain. Yeah, Spain or Mallorca in mm -hmm. general. Yeah. Not that we are experts, but we can try. <laughs> She's been living here for like total of almost three, three years. years. Yeah. So she knows the island. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that was everything. And thank you for watching, like you said. Yeah. Bye. Bye.